We have two cameras here. We have the Fuji X-T100 and the Canon M50. Yeah, this is a white one, that's a black one. Okay, let's just turn seven. We got her new camera for her birthday. Yeah. We got the Fuji X-T100. We've been playing around with it, testing it out. She likes the camera, it's, it takes really good pictures, but the autofocus is kind of slow. We decided to look for something else and we found the Canon M50 on sale for about the same price as the Fuji X-T100. Earlier we took some uh, tests with the cameras, so we're going to show you the tests that we did. Now the autofocus on the Canon is a lot better than the Fuji. It tracks her faces, her face, and also the lighting looks a lot better. The lighting stays a lot more consistent. And the Fuji kind of goes up and down, up and down throughout the whole thing. Yeah. Right? Mm -hmm. It gets darker, it gets brighter, and it's just not very nice. And, and then all, this oh, one just stays like bright and smooth. These are for beginners, so we put them in full auto and let it do its own thing. Because that's how most people that buy these cameras are going to start out. That's how a seven-year-old is going to do it. So, yeah. right? Mm -hmm. So what did you think about the footage between both of them? Um, I think this one was the best because... And tell them to. What? Tell them to. Tell them. I know I am. I just thought that this one was the best because it's kind of like the same reason as Dad, but I really like the lighting in this one, and the, it was really smooth and nice, and it focused on anything that we really needed to like focus on, like the main characters. Who was the main character? Me and Jax, and Haley, and you, and the dog. <laughs> it's the Fuji, still nice camera. Takes very nice pictures. And uh, the difference between pictures is really subjective. You know, mm -hmm. I like the way the Canon pictures look better, but she liked the one outside of the Canon better, but the we have one inside the Jeep, she liked the Fuji better. For young people, you have to do that camera. No, you're young, so you're using that camera. You want something fast. Well, I'm bigger than like four years old. A uh, four year old's not really gonna have a camera. A seven year old maybe shouldn't even have that camera. Let's see how you do. I'm gonna do good. I'm sure you will. I really want to be a photographer when I grow up like you. It's wonderful. I'm gonna take pictures. I'm gonna use your camera. That's why you have that. You take a whole bunch of pictures, whatever you want. Yeah. What do you I like about the camera besides the picture quality and the way it focuses? I like the color and I like the grip because it's like nice and big and... Yeah, you can actually grip it. So this one... That one is a little small. Small. And actually, it didn't even have one on there. It comes with this little grip that you put on with a plastic yeah. screw. But this grip is like an inch. Yeah. You actually have room to put your hand. Yeah, room to put your hand. It actually fits my hand pretty well, too. I have a lot bigger hands than hers. Yeah. Yeah. And it's like a little lighter than that one. So, like, when I hold it, it's not like heavy because I've. I'm, yeah. I'm not strong like as you because you're yeah, bigger no. than me. Yeah, so that one was a little like hard to like put it like over there. Yeah, it's a little bit heavier. Now yeah. I can just do it with one hand instead of two hands like holding it like that. I could just hold it with one hand. Good. So we have the the Rode Video Micro for her. Yeah. And it plugs right, right in, in to the camera on the Canon. It has a 3.5 millimeter jack, so it plugs right in. And the Fuji has a 2.5 millimeter jack, so you need another adapter, which is kind of a pain in the butt. So that's another good thing about the hand cannon, you don't need that and extra adapter hanging around. Yeah. Both cameras, both screens flip around. So it flips around like this. And the Fuji flips around and it also tilts. Since this is called this. a ba bald cat, I feel like it's, it's not a bald cat. Dead cat. A dead cat. It's so really I just a windbreaker or wind jammer. Yeah, but I actually think that it's a, a dead cat. No, a dead Why cat. is it called a dead cat? That's just specific to call it. Oh. Well, it's fuzzy. <laughs> so I'm supposed to like really, really the bad devil. She's a devil cat. But she wasn't mean to me. Mm -hmm. Only mean to you. The screen also rotates out, rotates in, and then when you close it, you can have the screen away, so you don't have to worry about it getting damaged. Yeah. The Fuji, the screen is always out. You can't ever face it in. It doesn't do that. It does. Yeah, like, if you drop it, up. then the screen will, like, break. 
or down a little bit, which is kind of nice. I mean, just at that angle, you can tilt it up a little bit better, which the Canon, you have to pull all the way out before you tilt it. But it's not a big deal. I still like the way this works better. But I like that one better. I still like it. I like the color. I really like white, red, and black, too. Also with the Fuji, there's no dedicated video <clears throat> switch style. It's just, it's all different photo yeah, like styles. And then whatever setting you have your your photo settings at is what it's gonna be for video. So you have the camera and the record button and that's whatever it is, what it is. So the it. green little thing is the pictures and then and yeah. this is the camera, I like the video one. Yeah. Canon has its own video dial, so you can have it set how you want it. And then every time you go there, it's set the way you like it. So that's nice. Instead of having to sit there and change your photo settings, video settings all the time, you just leave it where you like it, and you switch over your video and it's ready to go. Super easy, especially for a kid. Can, are we going to end this video? We can do. Okay. Thanks for watching. Peace, love, unicorns. <laughs> Photography. Okay, so that's the ending to her channel. What's ending to my channel? Um, I don't really have an ending. This is the first video I'm doing from my channel. You can do photography love Jay. I'm not doing photography love Jay. That's it. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.